What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to Air Trafficking. I got a uh, special unboxing today. It's one of my grails. I've been after this shoe for a good while now and I finally decided to break down and get it. Um, as you know, if you read the title, um, it is a Doran Becker shoe. A little bit of history about uh, Jordan Brand's partnership with Doran Becker is that each year uh, they partner up with the hospital, well it's a children's hospital in Oregon and they select a handful of kids to design their own uh, and that then gets sold and auctioned off for charity most of these shoes are very limited and sought after that makes them a little hard to find but when you do find them just be advised the price could be pretty steep for you to acquire them. Uh, this here is the uh, Air Jordan 3 Retro DB this particular shoe was a re-retro from 2013. It originally released in 2010. And um, we had the pleasure to see it a second time. The designer the Dornbecker 3's name was Cole Johansson. He originally did it in 2010. They re-retroed them in 2013. He had lymphoma, which is a cancer that attacks your immune system. I do believe he's beat it now. But in designing the shoe, he chose to go with the red, obviously, with like a diamond pattern here. And if you look at the gold accents, you can see that it spells his name going across. Uh, there's a C-O-L and then E. The shoe also features a 3M wrap around the uh, midsole there uh, underneath the elephant print. And it also illustrates uh, two of his favorite things, which is under this back tab, spaghetti. And under this one, he has a uh, chocolate cupcake or something like that. The shoe does come with an extra set of gray laces. I'll be probably just keeping it in the black. And uh, inside the insole, I'll try to throw it up on their screen here. But he has uh, strength on the left shoe. And in the right shoe, it says courage. Which he says that strength and courage are two things that people need the most. Overall, I'm happy to finally get these grails in my collection. Man, I've been out there for a while. Only thing I can say I'm kind of disappointed about is that the suede on the upper here it's kind of rubbed off on the gray liner here. So I'll probably have to contact them about that. Again, that's probably due to it being in the box store for so long. Thanks to everybody that has entered the contest. It does end tonight. And I'll definitely shoot a video updating you guys on who the winner is. I appreciate all you guys' support. Do me a favor and follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat at the name you see in the bottom right-hand corner. Stay tuned because I got more videos coming soon. Go on. Thank you.